past couple weeks, I've seen a lot of videos going around trying this, trying that, testing TikTok life hacks. I want to try. I got to make this unique to me and do it with art. Welcome back. Today we got 10 TikTok art hacks. You never knew you needed until now. Even if you're not into art, these might still be cool. Maybe one day you want to make your white shoes better. Or maybe your horse doesn't go to school. You'll see what I'm saying later in the video. Today, we're gonna be testing out these hacks. And I say we, because I have a special guest in the building today. Let's go take a look. Okay. My mom. Hack number one. I'm gonna be tie-dyeing using shaving cream. We put it all in a big tub and then started putting the thickened dyes on. I started going through and marbling it. So now it is finally time to dip the shoes in our shaving cream and dye. This is what they look like in regular sunlight. And I'm, oh, whoa. Okay, for this hack, you need a bucket, shaving cream. I got rich and thick, my favorite. Some fabric paint and some white canvas shoes. Tape them up and... All right, this worked. That'd actually be really cool. Hydro dipping's so messy. And it smells good, so... Okay, then you like swirl it around, I think, like this. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Like that? There's no way this is gonna look good. <laughs> so... Dang, that does look cool. All right, so now you just rinse it off and then it's supposed to be like a custom shoe. Let's see. Oh, that's kind of cool. No way. That's pretty cool, actually. <laughs> How? Oh my. This is actually a really cool looking shoe. Your turn, mom. <laughs> I'm gonna film something to make you look really cool, okay? Don't I already look cool? Yours is better. Mine's better? Duh. Guys, I think this was a success. We're gonna throw this in the washer and then we'll see. All right, hack number two, cotton ball mirror, cloud mirror, whatever. Here's the clip. Everybody wanna sing, sing, sing. You're a winner when you sing, sing, sing. I've got a song, you hummer. Alright, so pretty much you just put the LEDs around the mirror and then cover it with cotton balls. Oh my gosh. It does, there's something so ugly in there. Look. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, so right now it looks like something you'd get for free and you wouldn't want it. You know? Alright, this is ready? Let's go. Okay, this thing's done. Actually, without the LEDs, it looks cool. Alright, let's turn the lights on. If this thing looks cool, then it officially was kind of worth my time. The moment of truth. Oh, oh, wow. That looks cool. This is my new cloud mirror. Doesn't it kind of look cool? This is easy, it's fun, it's cheap, and it looks cool, kind of. Hack number three. Alright, so pretty much you cover your yarn in paint and then like pull it and you make a super cheap art piece. That's the hack. Step one, paint your canvas with a lighter color. It looks like a piece of poop on a canvas. If I pull it, now it's gonna make something really cool. I, I hope. That kind of looks cool, what the heck? Dang, that's fire. Let's just cut that, or what? <laughs> Alright, hack number four. So if you want to customize your shoes, but you suck at art, but you're good at taping. I needed someone who's not good at art, so I brought my mom. What I'm trying to say is a good tape job on the shoe. You can pretty much do anything and it'll look good. Here's a shoe, I taped it. Take it away. Hack number five. So you know when you get your paintbrush and you forget to wash it, it's all hard like this and you can't use it. Don't throw it away because there's a way to fix this. You can get this stuff called Pledge. This is for like polishing wood furniture and stuff. Let's see if this works. Oh wow. Let's wash it. Alright, that actually works pretty well. Hack confirmed. <laughs> I 
So technically you can make anything look good with a blue marker, a red marker. I'm gonna do something simple for you guys, okay? I'm gonna draw a little self-portrait. Now, take your red marker, draw the exact same thing, but a little bit to the right. Okay, then you take your blue marker and draw the exact same thing, a little to the left. Then you do little lines, like, coming off the colors, and it's supposed to look 3D. This looks kind of 3D. I think this is pretty cool, actually. It works. Okay, so you know when you're drawing with crayons, no one ever uses the white crayon. What's wrong with the white crayon? But today we're actually gonna do something with it. So, you take something white, you can use a piece of paper, canvas. I'm gonna draw something real quick. Can't really see what you're drawing, so it makes it a little hard, but... Alright, I just did a little something to see if this works first. Alright, now you're supposed to watercolor over this, and it should paint everything except the white crayon. Is it showing up? No. Hold on. It didn't work. Busted! Okay, right, before I go on to the next hack, this shoe's dry and it looks terrible, but now let's take off the tape. I thought you said I did good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's that, laces? Alright, this is a shoe. Um, it actually doesn't look terrible. It's not the best, but you kind of understand the idea. We didn't try it all, but if you try it just a little bit, it might look good. <laughs> Alright, now since I made you guys buy a pack of crayons just for this white one, and then it still didn't work, I'm sorry. But now you can use the rest of the crayons and make something cool. I did this in like third or fourth grade, so it's like good bringing back memories, you know. Glue these all down. I covered all the top of the crayons. Just ignore that one square right there. I didn't have enough. Alright, now you take a heat gun. Time lapse. Okay, I would not recommend this. I don't know where you put that. Sorry I made you buy crayons. If you were looking for something to do, uh, just keep looking. Ooh, I really want some cereal right now. What the heck? I'm out of bowls. Oh. Don't show those. Okay, sorry. I need a bowl. What can I do? I'm in a pinch. Let's make a bowl. All right, so to make a bowl, you actually need a bowl. <laughs> All right, so you can make a bowl, but if you have a gross one, I don't want to use it. Take the bowl, put a little oil inside, and then you just fill the bowl with beads and then kind of press them up around the sides. Now, it says put it in the oven for a couple minutes. Nobody got time for that. Let's go in the microwave. Hopefully this works. So you just pop this in the microwave. I left it in there for 10 minutes because it wasn't cooking. I don't know if you want to eat cereal out of that. All right, I'm gonna try to get this out of the bowl. So you gotta sacrifice your real bowl to make this really awesome bowl. If you're a child, I wouldn't recommend this. If you're an adult, I also would recommend this. Oh, there we go. That is my new bowl. There's already a little bit of design in the bottom. Burnt. It's not burnt. It's a design. Next hack, you're gonna need a pair of pants. I'm doing my mom's pants, and then I'm gonna surprise her with them as a thank you for helping me with the video. And I didn't want to ruin my own, so you're gonna want to tape off a cool design or words or something. All right, then you want to take bleach and just like spray your stencil, and then you want to do that. <coughs> take the tape off. There you go. And then it's like on your pants. I wrote pant, so she knows they're her pants. Just one of them, pant. Obviously, you can do like a more detailed design. I just did something simple, so it's like, Mom! These were my favorite pair of pants. Pant. <laughs> there you have it. 10 life hacks that might just better your life. Maybe you want to start trying it, because these also literally weren't hacks at all. They were just me trying out different art things. If you like the video, subscribe. If you might try any of these out on your own, I would recommend. I don't think a single one of them I'd recommend, except the first one. That one was cool. Subscribe if you like what you see. Not this. But like the part, the, the entertaining part. Shout out to my mom. Uh, I know her for a long time, so she, it was really cool for her to come on the show. Goodbye.